Oh no, I see that. No, no. Yes, no. I won. All, All right, right, Betty, pay up. Thanks, Betty. That was very hard and confusing, but I won an arrowhead. I hate these sliding puzzles. I really do. Okay. Full disclosure. Had to look at a walkthrough. That was insane. <laughs> Why did you put that charm above Linda's door? I was only trying to help Linda. Hmm. Oh, I am at a loss as to what to do about her. A complete loss. I thought that perhaps a charm would help. Whatever it is that's plaguing that poor thing. Uh, I still kind of suspect you, but that was surprisingly nice. Oh! Oh my god, I bet I can use that to hit the thing in the thing! Here it comes! Woo! Oh, there's a little clock thing. Can I help? <gasps> Christ! I guess I should explain. Fucking I hell. Did not the wand is mine. Oh wow, it's like a, it looks like a proper magic wand. Cool. Sounds like I did something right. Yes! Oh, and then... Oh, uh, whoa. Whoa, something tells me I just succeeded in lighting the forge. Woo! Okay. We've lit... We've lit... We've lit... We've lit... Am I having a stroke? We've lit the forge! <laughs> now the oil is fueling the fire in the forge in the old alchemy lab. Cool. So. Uh, I never found, I went to Jane's room looking for the stupid book. I couldn't find it, so. She's probably sleeping. Crap, what time is it? 9 p.m. How old is Jane? She looked, well, no. Yeah, she's probably young enough to have a 9 p.m. bedtime. What check was that? Oh. Where'd this come from? What the f- Doom shall come on swift wings to thee who has seen forbidden things. Cool rhyme. Um, this looks like it came from a wolf. Cool. Well. If anything, that's a sign that I'm on the right track, right? Um, so, I need to sleep all the way until the afternoon so I can go back into Jane's room. I'm glad that I've just got the wand in my hand now. I'm just gonna keep this in my hand, because it's cool. And now what? Hello? More chanting or something? More scratches or anything? Still the same scratches as before. Hello? I don't see anything. Don't see anything weird. Why? Why did I just wake up? I just go back to bed. Is my food here yet? <laughs> Damn it! I'm never gonna get my snack. And a message in my room. Yeah. Yeah. I don't seem to have the thing. Okay, whatever. Oh, did I set my alarm for 2 a.m. instead of 2 p.m.? I bet that's what it was. Nothing woke me up. I'm just an idiot. <laughs> Oh. What? <laughs> what is happening? Were there psychedelics in my mashed potatoes? there this time. At least that time it was definitely, you know, something definitely woke me up that time. It wasn't like me being an idiot. Oops, still nothing going on out here though. Back to bed again. Is there anything weird at the window? It looked like there might have been something weird at the window. No? Okay. 
Well, just people disturbing my sleep. Pretty rude. I already disturbed my own sleep by setting an alarm for the middle of the night. Alright, will I be able to sleep to the daytime this today? Yes, looks like it. Hi, Jane. Hi. I should get going. Bye. Jane's still in a bit of a mood. Still a bit sus. Um, okay. Book. I was told something happens if I click on this a bunch of times, so... Bear with. I don't think that was true. Otherwise... <laughs> Otherwise, someone's, someone's bamboozled me real good. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Okay. What's that? Why have I got an egg now? Oh, from the chicken thing? Oops. Well, cool. Thank you to the person who informed me of this. Oh, is it this book? Oh, this is the, yes, this is the picture book. Okay. Um, we exposited about this on the phone to, oh, I've forgotten his name, so I better take some pictures. I'm taking pictures again. Yep. Yep. There's a lot going on in here. Okay. Well, I mean, Jane sounds a lot more cheerful than she was before. Do do do. So. Yep, blah blah blah. Here's your pipe. Ethel caught me. Uh huh. I'm sure I'm supposed to do something to do with the coat of arms. Uh. Hang on. Some of them have these weird symbols at the end of them. Were these in... <laughs> Look over the photos I just took one minute ago. Were these in any of this stuff? Let's just take a picture of all of these that have the little... symbol at the edge of them. I don't know what to do with this information. But let's do it. Do 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 do. Whatever this is has got to be complicated, right? It feels very complicated. Let's get over here. Nope. Yes. Yep. Nope. Yep. Oh shit, this isn't the, um... The mould thing. Is this the mould thing? No. Yeah. How, but how... What, is this like... Oh my god. Because I would not know what order they're supposed to... Oh, I suppose they're, they're maybe in order the way I should have taken the photos in order. Okay, well, I can maybe look at them as I go. I bet that is it. I bet that's it. That means this one would be a cross. Let's undo the other thing I got. So, cross, nothing, line down the middle. 
across, nothing lying down the middle. Nothing cross. Cross, nothing lying down the middle. Nothing cross. Nothing. Line down the side. Wait, there's not enough for all of the... Or maybe there is? Oops. We need to put this away. Oh no, it's the other side. Oops. And then line on the left. I don't feel like there are enough. Or maybe... The oh, God, I don't know. I'll just keep going. Line on the right. So nothing line on the right. Oh, I don't know if that's right. Nothing lying down the center. No, I'm gonna run out of space. So it must be skipping the ones that aren't a thing. Okay, well that's fine. I can make that up quite easily. And then this and this. Uh, line to the right. Straight line. Oh god, I hope I'm getting this right. <laughs> I'm a little bit stressed out about this. Cross. Nothing. Line to the left. Oop. Nothing. Line to the left. There's only one left line in the middle. That makes me think like feel like I've missed one. Let's just double check. I know this is annoying and it's, it feels like a waste of time, but let's double check. I hope the order isn't the other way. It would be like oldest first, right? Surely. Surely it would be oldest first. Cross. Cross, nothing, line. So cross, cross, line, nothing, cross. Cross, line, cross. Cross, line, cross. Nothing. Line to the right. Cross, line, cross. Line to the right. Line to the left. Cross, line, cross. Line to the right. Line to the left. I don't even know if it goes across and down in this order. Oh shit, there's one missing, isn't there? The one with the gargoyle. I've got it on a piece of paper. I bet that's the missing one. And then a line to the right. There. So I bet if I just shimmy these along... Line to the... Wait. No shit, line to the right. And then... Missing one? Oh my god, I'm not sure. Dash, dash! Is it this one then? I think so? Okay, I checked on the internet and I had the right idea but the wrong execution. So this is what it's supposed to be like. I don't know how you were supposed to work out what order they were meant to go in. That seems a bit poopery scoopery. It takes ages to redo. Uh, gargoyle. What was it? One, two, one, 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 two, one. God, where I remembered that. Is this one? Oh, that's the people into the room. Where somebody has put hair power into the into the moisturizer, clearly. Can I not just go through? Do I have to... Is this it? 
forgotten where I'm going a little bit. Wait, isn't it this way? Hello, trying to get to the forge. Okay, yeah, good. Great. So open, close. Open, close. Turn around. Oh, we're pro. We're so pro now. Okay, so the forge should be... The forge is lit. It's well lit. Is that right? Is that the right, correct use of the... Oh, wow, molten metal. Look at it bubbling away. Ooh. That doesn't look like how they There, could that looks right. Does it? Yay! Okay. Great. I must go in here. Uh. Wait, is it this? Oh, okay, great. Whatever you just found, it's mine. I'm the pendant and not you. Besides, I would have found it before you did if I didn't have to sit there all day learning all that other silly rubbish. What is that? Oh, uh, I d uh. Looks, Looks like a meteorite. Like a meteorite. A rock? 600 years of secrets and mystery and puzzles all because of a stupid rock? No way. There must be something under it. No, don't touch it! Uh... Jane, I told you not to touch it. Jane! Wait, I died? I have to do that all again because I, I, I got there and opened it and I died. I'm in shock. I guess I was supposed to run. Oh my God. I guess I was supposed to run. Wait, I can save the current game, but I died. What second chance? Will that bring me back to life? No, don't touch it! Oh, this is a thing. I didn't realize this was a thing. Help! Oh, Nessie, help me! It's, it's <laughs> black in here. I can't see anything. Get me out of here, please! I'm sorry I was mean to you before. I'm sorry for everything! This is the time where I just fuck with her, like, do I detect a guilty conscience? No, she's a kid scared in the dark. What okay, do you mean help. by everything? It's my fault, Linda's sick. I mean, she's not really sick. I just made her think she is. <gasps> I curse in her room and gave her allergy pills and put her medicine in a moisturizer. Jane did it. Oh, well, I was totally wrong. You made her think that she's changing into the Beast of Blackmore, didn't you? I just wanted to go away. I just wanted to be Daddy and me and Mommy, my real Mommy. Please don't make me talk anymore, Nancy. <gasps> There's no air in here. I can't breathe. I've got to figure out a way to get that box off of her fast. You can breathe. Um. I'm running out of air. No, you're not. Stop being dramatic. Nancy, hurry. Oh, can I get the robot to help? Robot. Ah, it's kind of a robot. Laugh if I just ran away. Can I... That. Oops, what happened? I don't know where he needs to go. Oh, the box is there, it shows me. Okay. <laughs> that was so weird. Dear Ned, well, there is a beast of Blackmore. Jane. She made poor Linda think she was turning Jane. into a monster by putting her uncle's hair restorer in Linda's moisturizer. She also <laughs> slipped Mrs. Drake's allergy pills into Linda's food so she'd feel woozy all the time. An extremely dangerous thing to do. Yeah, what the hell, Jane? Jane's father was very upset, especially when he found out Jane had done it because she still wants him and her real mother to get back together. After Jane apologized to Linda and Hugh apologized to both of them, 
They all resolve to do whatever it takes to become a real family. As for Blackmore Manor, ever since I told him about all the passageways and gadgetry I discovered, Hugh has become fascinated with his family history and has asked, no, ordered Ethel to teach him what she's taught Jane. And while he doesn't believe for a second that the meteorite in that old alchemy lab has magical powers, he has encouraged Jane to come up with a puzzle to help Aww. ensure safekeeping, just as initiates have been doing for centuries. Which reminds me, the Pendulum swore me to secrecy when it comes to all their traditions. <laughs> Nancy! So don't tell anybody any of this, okay? You shouldn't Nigel have told Ned in a letter. Was up when he came to get his laptop and has been hounding me ever since. This is just the kind of stuff he'd love to include in that unauthorized tell-all he's trying to write. If he calls me I thought it one was more authorized. time, I'm telling on him. To Mrs. Drake. <laughs> That'll teach him. Ever yours, Nancy. Uh... Hey, sassy detective. Congratulations on cracking the case. You've been awarded the title of... Obscurum Passagium for finding your way in the dark. Ah, oh, thanks. The year Assist. is 1930, and everything is on the rise. Unemployment, government breadlines, and organized crime. In the mystery hall, <laughs> a heroine is born. Armed with only a, a heroine, a blue roadster, and a spirited resourcefulness, a 16-year-old detective will go on to inspire hope in the hearts of young girls and curses upon the lips of evildoers everywhere. Her name? Nancy Drew. That was so weird. <laughs> the secret of the old clock. So they are, they're ending the game with a, a trailer for the, and the next game. Oh, that was really fun. I, uh, I was totally wrong. They totally red herringed me with the stuff about the like six month clause. Although I guess that's probably not a red herring if Jane knew about it. So maybe Jane knew about it, and she was trying to, uh, she was trying to get Linda to move out. Man, that was actually kind of dark, because she was giving her, like, medication every day. That could have, like, she could have really hurt or killed Linda, especially as Linda was refusing to, like, eat properly and everything. Man, turns out Jane, not the fantastic kid that I thought, and Mrs. Drake genuinely trying to help. I got that. I got. I couldn't have got that more wrong. Oh, that was super fun. It looks like it took about six hours in all to uh, finish, which is not that bad. I shall definitely be playing more Nancy Drew in the future. So stay tuned for that. Next up, back to the sinking city to uh, crack on with that mystery. Thanks very much for watching, everyone. Have yourselves a very lovely week, and I will see you really soon!